What's up guys, welcome to today's video. Today I'm gonna be sharing with you how to cut the super popular wolf haircut in only a few steps. So let's get started. So the breakdown of the sectioning, super simple, center parting, and then we separate the front and back, following that hairline down to the nape. Uh, and then we go straight down center back with our parting and then across the occipital bone in the back. And that really breaks down all of the sectioning. If you're confused by any of these terms, make sure you go to shop FSE and download my uh, haircutting system that we just launched a couple weeks ago. Um, and you can learn all about terminology, learn all the basic haircuts, everything. It'll really set you up for success with your haircuts. So now that the sectioning is complete, we're going to start on the right hand side. Uh, diagonal back parting tool of choice today is going to be the Tri Razor by FSE. If you're looking for a new razor tool, this is the coolest thing ever. Uh, it's got three tools in one. We're prepping the hair with tea tree uh, hemp replenishing hair and body oil. It soothes, smooths, and shines up the hair. Uh, and it's great for razor cutting because it just allows that cuticle to be soft and it allows the razor to glide through the hair. Uh, the way that we cut it is super simple you're bringing everything to the front and drawing that line the thing I love about the wolf haircut is that perimeter line how it descends so quickly to the back so we're gonna call this an open haircut uh, and we're just really working that line through and then I'm connecting the back so once I get that point cut in the front I'm connecting the back through and now we're gonna do the same thing on the left hand side so a slight diagonal back parting bring everything to the front and draw that front hairline, really connecting that fringe area through it. So just see how I slide the tri razor through all the way in, keeping the hair nice and short, descending that line again towards the back. Uh, and I just keep working until I run out of hair. So as I finish this first portion of the tutorial, I want to share with you guys something really special to me that I've been working on. This video is sponsored by the new FSC haircutting system available at shopfse.com. This system was designed for individual stylists, salons, and schools. Included in the FSC haircutting system, you get a digital haircutting book, printable head sheets for each haircut, eight step-by-step -step videos, terminology 101 video, and also a completion certificate that you can hang in your salon or school. To download your copy of the FSE haircutting system, go to shopfse.com. Can't wait for you guys to see it. Thank you so much for the support. All right, so now as we move into the back of the head, we're going to be using the Texture 50 side of the Tri Razor. Uh, this thing is great because you don't actually have to layer the hair. You can actually just go in and remove some of that weight, create some texture just by gliding that Tri Razor through. So I'll do that just on that bottom portion. And now we're going to rotate, creating open layers throughout the right hand side in the crown area. So see how I'm scooping the hair up and then I just slide through it. You're really just going to determine when you're cutting with a razor how long you want those layers to be. So I'll just pick my point and then I draw it, glide it through and connect it with the bottom. So I'm rotating pie shaped sections all the way to behind the ear. One thing I want you guys to note as you watch this happen is that I'm always combing that guide towards the new hair so that I'm in motion as I'm working in the round of the head. So pulling that guideline over and then cutting the new section. All right, and as I finish up this cut, I'm gonna add the do it all spray. I'm telling you guys, this does everything. It's tea tree hemp multitasking spray. Uh, it's gonna smooth stress strands. It manages frizz and adds shine. It really does everything. So I'm gonna add it to it. And I'm gonna hit it with a diffuser uh, and just really help bring a more natural style to this look. So just keeping everything soft and adding a little bit of volume using the diffuser. And then my favorite product ever is Paul Mitchell Worked Up Hairspray. So I spray that in to give me my final result. You can see it's a natural textured, uh, lived in volumized haircut. Uh, this is my version of the wolf haircut guys. I hope you guys like it. Let me know in the comments below, subscribe to the channel. Cause I got videos coming out all of the time and thank you guys so much for the support. Again, go to shopfse.com to pick up all of the stuff that you've seen on this video. Thanks for watching. There's a few things that you have to understand about haircutting before you can really jump into doing haircuts.
These are all things that I'm gonna teach you guys in the next eight haircuts. Truly understanding the why behind what you're doing in haircutting can make haircutting so much more fun and make you way more successful behind the chair.